Oh, shit, sure, that's through here. Who get a lantern? Oh, shit. Now there's a boss fight. Ah! ah. Good job. Ah! ah. ah. Okay, yeah, this is probably a bit of an issue. Um, so this is just like a guy. There's two of the guys. So there's two of them, though. Oh, this is on Steam Small. Basically. This guy's also pretty tough. He's he's a little bit harder than that purple dude that I thought, because that guy there is pretty much that purple dude that I thought. Oh, I got right. that. Great. This guy what has... What is a, that? He has poison imbued <laughs> attacks. Just so you know, that's that's the upgrade. Was he in this room before? Because I don't no, think he was. No, no, this was the guy who done like the yeah, crisscross attack that. that you figured out you just deflect when you there's a little flash. No, I mean, was... I don't think there was two people in this boss fight. No, no. wasn't it? No, well, you told me just say the Wesley. Started, yeah. The, the, the first but one. But one of them's was. not meant to be here. I don't think. No, they are. Right. Oh, for fuck's sake. He was standing on the left of the door. You can backstab. him. Right. Okay. There is no way, however, to backstab the <coughs> actual boss. So you have to do fight. Like you do have to fight. Two as long as it does. Right. Right. Okay. So sure. You should probably also get that shrine that you just like. Nah, fuck it. Don't need it. Yeah, probably should. Well, you wouldn't expect them to just put another boss. You know there. what? Shh. You should. It's Dark Souls. They've already put another boss there. They've they made you fight the monkey twice. <laughs> Yeah, they did make you do that, didn't they? He's in on the left. On the left, right. You can backstab him. See, this boss isn't that eventful, so I'm kind of fine with you, like, just like with giving you the answer to getting the cheap trick in. But... <coughs> don't, you... I thought I, I could, like... Don't, because you're just using bullets for no reason. I'm going to stop using them. There's no you fucking got, you animal! You one hit out of it, so it's not really worth it. You can make key to count with that. It's a thrusting attack. Right. How is One his leg spinning like fucking Chun Li? Oh, because he's a snake. Oh. <laughs> oh, I've got a divine confetti for one. Nah, but he's not a ghost. He could be a ghost. Looks fairly ghost. Oh, for fuck's sake. She's a dash. How is he making a counter again? You just dash into it. At the right time. Wait, you can make a counter his leg? Yeah, it's yes. a thrusting attack. That's what I said like That's fucking insane. two minutes ago. You know that one, it's a thrusting attack, so you can make it count. You can also <coughs> perfectly deflect it, but we know that isn't going to happen. Jump. If you double jump when they do it, where if you jump, pause, and then jump again while you're still in the if air, you, you kick them jump. in the head, yeah. and that does posture damage. Oh, so you jump in the air? Do well, you already done yeah. this with a monk? You jump and then jump again, like <coughs> as you're on your descent. You're an actual fucking mongo, by the way. You done this fight in the monk? What do you mean I done this fight in the monk? You get jump on them and then jump away. Yeah, you stagger them. But if you jump and then jump on the spot, you will kick them in the head and it does posture damage. So when they're down below half health, you're looking for those jumps. Right. You don't laugh, Get man. those you're jumps. Right. This guy's impossible. He's not. No, but he's, there's just there's no way to cheese him. Or, there are, everything in this game is harder than Fume Knight. Everything. <laughs> fucking everything. Everything in this game yet. is harder than Fume Knight. Apart from that one no, boss that you fought in the woods that you literally just couldn't possibly have lost to. Because there is a pinwheel in this game. That was a good eat your bungee. Tony, you're not saying Japanese sounds when you're fighting. sake. Everybody knows it makes you fight better if you pretend to be a samurai. But why do tennis players hit the ball and go <laughs> Because it just it hits it with more power. The worst, the worst <laughs> part is there's almost an argument in what you just said. That's I the worst bit. I think it's meant to be more of a, the grunt is a side effect of putting as much power into the swing as possible. No, it's the same like when healthy. All Might does his punch, there's like... Argh! I believed this until I seen <clears throat> Sharapova play. And I was like, you're just wanting to scream. Because <laughs> it's like a little tiny dunce where it barely goes over the net. She's like, ha! He's like, what are you, a Smash character? <laughs> like, fucking hell. <laughs> That's when I put tennis in the so, same, like, wavelength as WWE. <laughs> <laughs> it's not a sport, it's sports entertainment. <laughs> oh. You know what? Yeah, I'm fine with that. <laughs> I want golfers to start being it. I'm gonna be brilliant. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Why do these conversations start every time I need to play this? On the putting green. I just tried. <laughs> <laughs> just... <laughs> ah! Ah, I don't know what I'm doing. <laughs> Lining it up. He's taking the green. It's a bit of an incline, so we'll have to manage his shot accordingly. Ah! <laughs> ya bastards! Imagine you're, you're Snooker. Like... <laughs> <laughs> what sports can we make better with tennis grunts? Snooker! Ah! <laughs> Ping pong, I guess. Uh, Snooker would essentially become like a much smaller version of gymnastics! Ah! Pole vaulting would be the greatest. <laughs> no, sprinting! 100 meters <laughs> <laughs> ah! In the last 20 meters, they just explode. 
I actually thought I, I would definitely be good because then you, you just see them like. I reckon we could probably shave a second off the hundred meters. I think if Usain Bolt was screaming, <laughs> like if he was putting so much power in that he couldn't control his screams, he'd have probably made that in a much quicker time. I think so, yeah. I think if you don't perfect deflect that, the poison still uh, hits through it. Oh my god, you actually clipped him. I think you hit him with a fucking... Uh, the, the hilt? I'd say maybe even the fucking guard. Slut! <laughs> <laughs> you got me like the bottom bit. Yeah. Just... Fuck you in the nut with it. No! <laughs> Water <laughs> polo! <laughs> it would just feel like mostly gargled screams though. I bet it makes a lot like they're all drowning. <laughs> <laughs> That's what sport needs. Drowning people. Um, oh, or, right, um, normal polo, like on horses, but it might just spook the horses and then wacky things will happen. Wait. Oh, in fact, and so what could be made better with, um, with tennis teams, what could be made better with uh, poorly timed air horns? Snooker. <laughs> I mean, yeah. <laughs> Races. 100 meter sprint. Races. Imagine that. The Grand National of the horses. <laughs> Just uh, 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 I know. Um, fucking figure skating. Guy goes up for the fuck. Opera. <laughs> it's a sport. It could be. Fishing. But it would be better. Synchronised opera then. Does that make it a sport? <laughs> I wonder how many hole, hole in one. Like, do you know, Let's be fair. A hole in one is so statistically unlikely. Oh yes, yeah, so it's almost impossible because it requires perfect trajectory. No one tried your woods 2007 on the wee bar. Like, you need Usually to... you know their wind's gone the right way and that's you, you've done it. Aye, but Gary, see in real life, people don't have the wee markers that tells you where the ball's going to land. What? What's the point in playing then? But it's, it's like, it's, it is almost an impossible feat because you have to get the wind right, you have to get the power in the swing, you have to get the arc right, and if it lands before the hole, you have to like... You have to basically it's almost mentally calculate where it's going to go once it lands. So I'm convinced it's just luck and nothing more. <laughs> just, like that's why, because it's so many things to fucking calculate. Like you have to like no matter how good you are, right? Yeah, it's something that on the spot you wouldn't possibly be able to calculate. Like I think even with years of practice on the same course, you would still struggle to hold in one. Yeah, probably. Like yeah. I think it's something that a lot of people can't replicate, unless of course you're Kim Jong Il or whatever, and you can do it like oh, 15 hole in ones in his first time playing golf, Aye. some shit like that. Trying to say that he didn't he invent the cheeseburger? Like, what the fuck? What have I been reading? <laughs> it's, it's, it's funny to think that someone nowadays has the same god complex as Alexander the Great. Yeah, no, well, except he actually was pretty great. He oh, was great, shit, though, yeah, but this guy done nothing. That's why the god complex... Oh, my God. Though. Do you think he gave the moniker great <clears throat> to himself? Alexander the Great? Aye, so no, I like... think it was given to him by the uh, the Romans, like the the people, the nobles and the... Um, Throughout like the Roman government and that gave him the title because he was so such Google. a good fucking like conqueror. I mean the guy fucking. Aye, because Google was about fucking <laughs> in, in fucking whatever AD or whatever. It took it took him getting to India before they stopped him. He made it from Rome to India. Like fucking hell, man. King of Macedonia. Yeah. Conquered an empire that stretched from the Balkans to modern day Pakistan, which son of Philip the Second and Olympias. He got shot with an arrow at one of his last battles and survived. And then, um, before his next battle, he died on the way there. That was how he died. Wow. Oh, Stevens. He uh, he got wounded uh, when he took a small... Because uh, his men were very demoralised because this is like fucking eight years of campaigning they'd done. They were like, we want to go home. Can we please go home? He's like, okay, we'll go home. But we're not going to go back the way we came because that, that makes it look like we lost. So we're going to go this way <laughs> through some other lands and conquer some other stuff on the way. Um, and during one of the sieges, while his men were particularly demoralised, he gathered a group of his best men and uh, he stormed the wall with just them. And the rest of his army, like, after seeing him nope, do that, nope, they like, nope. got their shit together and ran him behind them. But by the time they got there, he'd already been shot with an arrow. Oof. He survived. Um, but the travels after that, he still had like side effects from the injury, but eventually he ended up coming down with like, fever and illness and died before he got to his next battle. So how do you know all this about fucking Alexander the Great all of a sudden? I watched a bunch of YouTube videos on it fairly recently, actually. Oh, okay. So it's still kind of like fresh in my mind. But yeah, it was, it was a pretty good conquest, to be fair. Nice, you've almost broken. Good shit. I just, it's just mental that the fucking like, AI can just deflect your attacks like fucking perfectly, man. Why shouldn't it? They're trained shinobi as well. It's unfair. They should, be, they should have all the tools that you have. So I, I, can, I can read his mind. Can, if you can deflect their combos, why can't they deflect yours? Alright, Phil. Oh, okay. Tony, did you watch Train at Bissan yet? No, not yet. You should oh, get on that shit you, because they're making a sequel. It's so good, man. It is like 28 days later good. 
I'm not joking, man. It's they actually really sellotape magazines to their arms so that the infected can bite them, they can fight them off. It's fucking great. <clears throat> I've watched it like, what, ten right. times? I'm never in my entire life going to be able to do this. I, I will never. I could go at this for weeks and never do this. It's the worst game of all time. It truly is. There's pe I, I'm, I'm you know what you sound like? You sound like the people who returned Dark Souls because it was too hard. That's what you sound like. The game isn't fair! No, I wouldn't return it. I would just. Uh, I would never be able to live it down if I returned it, so it would just stay under my bed oh, forever. So you'd be able to live down uh, constantly saying that it's impossible as long as you never return it. <laughs> even <laughs> though the game is very possible and you can do it if you just get good. Very possible. It well, is. Just get good at the game. See, Ryan, That's all it is. Ryan even came back from his exile. <laughs> Now go back to the shadows with you! Oh, See, look, Gary's almost done stage one. I mean, have you beat any boss? Any? Yeah. Is he it? beat the really easy one that you can't possibly lose to. It's right. on a par with Penguin. Okay. Has he beat any other ones? Uh, he has. Alright. He beat the monk, didn't you? Yeah. Yeah, so he, be he beat the monk. A bit of patience, a bit of trial and error. Have you beat any that you have to do two health bars? Uh... Without cheesing the first one, at least. Good question. Here, I don't know I why- I don't think the answer to that question is yes. Tony, you are the Bad question. <laughs> Tony, I don't get it. You're the editor in this situation. You don't know. Why don't you just make it that you never lose? Wait, why don't you, you just do edit out everything that you've been bad? Did you do the ogre or did Gary do the ogre? I the first know, boss. Ogre. I did the ogre. You did the ogre. Who did the boss after that? The, the fighty oh. guy. Me. Me. <laughs> what bosses has Tony done? Because um, Gary done Giobu. I've done that blue guy. Yeah, so right, yeah, he had two health bars. So that's one Shinobi boss with two health bars that you didn't have to cheese. Wait, did you not do the guy in the big armor? Or no. was that Steven? No, I did that. Of course. More expected at this point. Did Steven actually? Yes. Anyway, I'm away. Uh, how he's getting on. Anyway. But how the fuck does it look, Ryan? I'm sweating profusely. This has been, what, 30 minutes and this is the final Don't mind, I'm, I'm concentrating really hard right so now. So in terms of standard, like, Sekiro momentum, not bad. <laughs> About on a par. <laughs> How far in it are you now? Could you know? We're past halfway. All oh, right, cool. I would say we're getting towards the last third of the game easily. This is That's the most it. edgiest looking guy yet, I think. Look at his lone shadow, vile hand. Exactly. Hands so vile they named him after it. <laughs> I mean, I mean, look is at it. It's like that orc from Lord of the Rings with like the gommy hand. Yeah, without a doubt. Except he's got that another hand's lot of vile. No, no, the guy who's fighting movie with the gommy hand. Uh, yeah, yeah. Nice. What? what? The first one missed. Partner. You fucking talking shit! You can make your account of this last one. Ah, uh, is tracking. You got him. Yeah. Somebody got a back. Just stab celebrating just, the just blood fashion. <laughs> <laughs> Lump of fat wax. I deserved that there. Oh, his body disappeared before the cloud. Oh, it didn't. Damn, I thought his body would have vanished because it was a shinobi one. No. Never mind. That would have been really cool. If his body disappeared before the cloud did, because then it would have literally looked like you turned him into powder. Thank fucking god you done that, Gary. I Jesus know, I, I don't Christ. know how I did it. I just kept, I just, didn't even look at his poise. Like, you're just like, oh, you've nearly done it. And I was like, have it. Go to <laughs> the shrine. Where's the shrine? Just, oh, the back to the, the shrine. One, the back to the shrine. Go back oh. to the shrine. Tony never gets better at Well, that guy, I, I probably did get better at Dark Souls, statistically. Yeah, uh, but Dark Souls is like, how is Oh, no. So who's this? Gay fuck. This Cut is scene. a really, really, really good thing. <coughs> I just watch this. I just want to see the intro. And that's it. Oh, it's the wee boy. But he's not talking to you. It's not a third item when you get. Yeah, the branch. I know who that is. I know who that is. Someone stole it. That's your look. fucking dammy. It's, uh, it's Andre, isn't it? It's oh God, it is Andre. The guy who died in the Harata estate, <coughs> yeah. he's back. He's Somehow. like that Terminator, the liquid one. Just keeps coming back. Then why does he have a scar? He's like made a liquid. It's a liquid scar. It was funny. Uh, it's to be more intimidating. Look at his fucking hair. I know. Is that needle he's pure trying to draw on this child? Can we just skip this? So the basic gist of the cutscene is that um, he t he asks you either stand with me or stand with Kuro, and um, I get a pick, so I get to not fight one of them. Amazing, great. Well, you never fight Kuro. Kuro's the Can I just boss. backstab him? But this ends the game if you stand with him, essentially. Oh, sick! Right. No. Where do we don't. go? Don't. Where am I going? Talk to him. Talk to Evil. So, if you stand... <laughs> you so trying to end the game now. Basically, you guys. the way this works is that he goes, right, I want the line of the dragon blood for myself because he sees that Sekiro can constantly come back to life. So he wants that. 
Right. So he's like, Sekiro, abandon him and tell him to take me on as his shinobi. Break the code. Yeah, break the code. And But because Kuro wants <coughs> to end the line of the dragon, you decide, no, we're going to end the line of the dragon because that's what Kuro wants. So you betray your father and now you have to fight him and he's one of the best fights in the game. Why does Kuro want to end it? Uh, because he sees the damage that it does because men have been corrupted by it, like Genichiro. And what the fuck? People have been killed <laughs> over it, like it is the key to Ashina's power. But it's the reason so many people die, and it's the reason people come to Ashina for war. Right. So he wants to get rid of it so that it's not a thing that people can fight over anymore. But Owl wants it because he's like, if I can live forever, then I can continue my dynasty as the best shinobi who ever lived. So I see. you now betray him so that you're like, no, I will take the side of the little boy. He's got a fucking stage two as well. Guy's got a Murakumo. I just swing that boot like it means A not. man's katana. <laughs> <laughs> Only those little pussy wimp samurais would use a normal katana. Look at the size he's fucking thingy bar exactly. as well. I what? swear to God his like posture bar is bigger than like other cunts as well. Might be. It wouldn't surprise me if it was. He yeah. made a girl on me! He did. <laughs> he's the first boss in the game that can do it. <clears throat> That's awesome. That's shit! It's your turn. <laughs> I like how the game is made harder because it takes away some of the tools that you have and you're just like that's shit right cool so the boss will just randomly one shot you if you put out a fucking thrust no, attack it won't one shot you it's just Gary didn't have enough health to stand it that's all I don't think I've got enough health to fucking stun anywhere in this shit game oh. this is the part of the game that I love because oh, the, the, cool, what, the bit that I this is the bit I love slamming my head against the wall as well here. I mean, let's be honest, Gary, you're figuring the game no problem. Tony, on the other hand, yeah, no, I'm kind of getting there. Why, boy? Why do you do this to us? Enough talk. Been a while since we did this. Fucking deflected it. Fuck you. Fuck your president, man. Fuck you. I'll press it with my right hand there. Nothing but L1. There. Can I fuck up now? Can I blame it on my left hand? Fuck off! Have some of this magic elixir, child. It will give you the power to be good at games. I'm fucking pressing it! You're on the floor, you have to get up. <clears throat> Before that, obviously! The parent is absolute, Tony. How dare you go against daddy? He's literally grounding you for having a booze with your pals. Oh, this is, more than, I, this is more than I ground and you're getting some discipline here, boy. You've got no telly, your chores are doubled. He's giving you the belt every morning as a reminder. Such that his belt is the sword. I know how you beat him, I know how you cheese him. Phone childline. <laughs> <laughs> My dad's battering me. I will get the Polish run, son, don't you worry. I was like that, but I just wanted discipline. He's like, tell that to the court, tell trade that in, to the judge. Trade in your physically abusive father <laughs> for a sexually abusive one by the time we get you out of the system. <laughs> Childline, here to help, in some way. I am pressing it! He staggers you, he broke your posture, you have to dash to be, to be able to guard him. What? There's, there's, yeah. a, there's a fight with him later on in the game what? that you can get. Um, if you un if you unlock it, where you go back to where you fought Lady Butterfly, and he'll be here, he'll be there instead. Sick. And it's essentially a challenge fight where he gets a oh. bunch of new moves. Yeah, I'm worth it. He gets to use so you know Lady Butterfly had those, especially in like see if you got a new game plus, see because the game can't give you prayer beads or gold seeds anymore. It not. gives no because you already have the prayer beads. I and gold start seeds. Man. You, can, you can get up to ten Did prayer necklaces. You got up to ten prayer necklaces. Just any time you see him move, just press L1. <clears throat> You're only better at him when he comes to you. I don't know what you expect, but they're just to run in. Right there again. No, but this button doesn't do it. Do, but you know, dodging, they said the L1 button is important to this game. The L button doesn't do anything. But you're dodging and trying to block straight after it. Being so angry, you're denying the game works as intended. It, it absolutely doesn't. It, it does, fucking doesn't. It works. Do you know it right. works. I'll, I'll, I'll you seen me beat Orin right. doing literally nothing but blocking the last time we played. Ah, it's. <clears throat> so you've done better there in terms of just straight up fighting them. You just have to jump less. My You're jumping a lot in this. You've always done that though. For I, 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 I got that thing where you just keep saying one man until you do it. 
and it's leading to you getting a lot of like wasted time, and he's getting. <laughs> I'm, 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 you do it. I'm not doing it. Uh, good night, good night, good night. The poison is like the one thing you super the statue. Have to avoid. Uh, ah, the fucking statue, man. You're doing really well. I done so well. And I wasn't even drinking. I mean, you got light. Shit, but I know he's moving now. He's I a know. he's a tough fight. It's an intense fight. He's like really good at closing distance. Too tough. It's too hard. It's too hard. It is too hard. Not that hard. There's no way we can uh, end. There's no way we can end. End literally end. Him. No, you just have to bear it. Nice. The worst thing I'm absolutely lost at. <laughs> the one thing I can't do. I can cheese. I can look at my one true weakness. Getting good. Yeah, I'm just gonna see if there's a cheese for us. Here, this looks pretty good. You are unbelievable. Disgusting. <laughs> like who cheesed the boss? It was fucking one of these. <laughs> Disgusting. <laughs> <laughs> He's um. I don't think there is a rock bottom for you is what I've discovered at this point when it comes to this game. <laughs> I think you are by literally any means necessary. If there was a video out there that told you you could play this game better if you held a shit in your left hand <laughs> when you did, you'd do it. Look, all's fair in love and war, Steven. Rock bottom? What's that? This is Steven. such a good tech. You're wasting a lot of time here, Gary. <laughs> you are pathetic. Tony, I'm cheesing them right now. I'm just looking into the animation of... I'm telling you right now, you're no cheesing him. God, this guy, this guy's a saint. This guy's fantastic. It's not even taking a hit yet. No, why that is, Tony? Because he's really good at the game. He isn't. He's bad at the game. That's why it's cheese. <sighs> Better than Tony, but. Oh yes, this guy's sm This guy's what? The next level. You took half my whole health bar. Interesting that. Do. You could take both of his health bars really easily if you're doing this. I bet you still can't. You are so sad. Sad? I don't think I'm sad. Look, right. I win using my brain, Stephen. No, you win using someone else's <laughs> brain, Tony. <laughs> <laughs> this wasn't your brain at all. <laughs> right, we've been over this. What really no. constitutes intelligence, right, is being able to. Been able to problem solve, right? And if that involves interpreting other information that exists, that is, that is Tony, also. Interpreting is one word. Straight up stealing is something else. You didn't solve a problem. You googled the <laughs> answer. Right. In fact, we've had this discussion before where, right, we go, realistically... You're really putting me off. Memorising information doesn't actually mean anything. Right. So really, what matters now, because information has changed. Like, everybody has a brain in their pocket. I don't even remember anything. But if I know how to apply information, then that's what actually matters. People can stumble across information all the time, and uh, that's and we apply it. That's what I'm the games are. Fuck, man, we man. just collate everything, put a wee spin on it, and there you go. Right, but Tony, I understand putting cheese in a guide uh -huh, uh -huh. because we're showing people how to beat the game. Uh -huh, right? uh -huh, yeah. But this isn't a guide, Tony. <laughs> this is the first time you're playing the game. Actually, beat it. Like actually, just have some time. <laughs> like. You don't represent the channel, but we get lamped in <laughs> you. And if one of us is like, there is no, there is no depths that I shall not sink, then that unavoidably washes off on me and Gary. Well, I think and I've... then the video, <laughs> looking up someone else's YouTube to see how to cheese a boss because you can't play Sekiro, and going here, this is pretty good, isn't it? It is. It's just. Were you watching what he was doing? Yes, I seen what he was doing. I know it exists. <laughs> <laughs> it's sad, <laughs> and I won't you know be what? a part of it. You know what? <laughs> you know what's sad? The amount of people that have banged their head against a brick wall trying to beat this boss when he's actually incredibly easy, Gary. You know what? You know what? If only Hitler had googled how <laughs> do I beat war, <laughs> and then he'd have maybe won. <laughs> <laughs> Two flasks used, <coughs> three pellets. <sighs> well done. See? We thought this shit. <laughs> Look at him! He's two flasks down in stage two of the fight. <laughs> oh. Three pellets, mind you. Do you know what got him there? What? His pride. His honour. His skill. That and I'm determined, oh, Steven! That's weird because it's all qualities you I've You know what's going to get you there? Someone else's lack of pride <laughs> and lack of skill. Which you're going to steal and go, Oh! I'm going to do that! No, you, know what, you know what the real victor is? Like, the real victor here. The pr 
So me as I your playstyle off other people. <laughs> I'm not going to do what's fun. I'm just going to do what makes me win. Nah, right, because that's the thing. Oh winning God. is fun. That's winning is fun. I think God. Oh, we've crafted this game to be as difficult as possible. But no, I find a way to make your your shitty game no, easy. No, I'm not losing you, any sleep here. You didn't find any way. You found a video of someone else who found a way. You had no intelligent merit involved in this thing other than going to YouTube and going, how do I not lose? Well, I think that's up for interpretation. I think there's only one way to interpret- You have video evidence, you fucking goon of you doing you it! You literally are so sure that you cannot beat this game that you are now on video looking at other YouTubers to I'm see- I'm I would- <laughs> You could give me a month and I would- I couldn't even take a health bar off this guy. I guarantee, after three fucking hours of you fighting Genichiro 1v1, actually fighting him and not dashing and jumping around and learning to play the game, you beat him. I guarantee it. Ah, uh, you know how to beat Genichiro, him because I'd look up how to beat him. No, if you fought Genichiro 1v1, if you just beat him, it unlocks the rest of the game essentially and how you're meant to play it. It unlock you essentially figure it out. That's Gary's all been making this guy look pretty easy, not gonna lie. Because he's gotten good at the game. You haven't. He's fighting him. Properly fighting The him. game is biased against me. No, you're biased against the game. You are determined to play the game with dashes and jumps. And nothing more. Because you're like, I don't need to block, I'll just get out of the way, but you can't get out of the way. Because the enemy- But doesn't let me block, you fucking see that mashing L1! You, you have yeah, just watched me do it. You're just not Fuck getting the that. timing right. Change your timing then. But Gary has been doing it this entire fight. He's on to the second stage again. In two boss fights, he's made it to the second stage. Uh, Unlucky, but well done. I right, pee. Let's take a break and cool off. And you can consider... Any minute that's fucking shite in your room! <laughs> you can dig deep, Tony. And see if there's anything there resembling pride left. Or if not, at least look at the pride that me and Gary have and try to assimilate that in pride, yourself pride. in some way. You know what pride you know what pride got the fucking the, the fucking commander of the Titanic? He's stood at the bottom of the ocean for pride. See me, I'd be wearing a fucking shawl going, Oh let me onto the boat, I don't Women and children me. first, excuse me. I'd be dressing up as a wee lassie, women and child. Pride can be someone's greatest fall, but you still need to have some. Otherwise what are you? You're not even a man. Look where Pride got Vegeta. Eh? Vegeta's shagging Bulma! Right, and? And, when you were young, you wanted a piece of Bulma! <laughs> <laughs> but Pride got him fucking blown up, killed himself with his aim Pride because of fucking boo. Look at that. But you know who's alive? Go on. You know who's- you know who's deed in Vegeta, isn't he? Goku! How'd it go for Goku, everybody's hero? <laughs> eh? Tony, you're Goku! <coughs> you're lying on other people's power, you sad bastard! I know. Where would you be with our power for the spirit bomb? How would you even have a channel? You know what I'd be? Part 60 on, that's where I'd be! And get behind it. Right. Reload my assault rifle. So now, there's a bit of a field between the town that was giving me cover on my retreat and the, the woodland that I've taken cover in. So they come out of the town, pushing across the field towards me. I'm just gonna do the cheese method. No! You're right, let's, no, let's actually no. make some progress. I'm doing so good. Because the fuck if you're doing good, just don't die and let's just get it undone with. Like, as that, a why couldn't I get under him? <clears throat> God, you just, I don't like any country. Though. Really? Yeah. Especially on this like new wave of like pop country. It's so bad. It's actually been out for a while. There's also all it is is just pop music, but it also <clears throat> has an acoustic guitar and some fucking whiny text. I, I, I had no idea that I apparently held that attack long enough to get thrust in. Would you like me to try? I, I want to no, try. No, no, I want to no. try the cheese method again. You can try the cheese. I don't think I'm going to beat him this try. Like, I'm too out of it and he's a, he's a tough boss. I mean, it took me like, what, five tries to beat Genichiro when I done it for the last three? Five this or six tries? literally hard on if you make. Well, yeah. Get to fuck your side jokes. Stop reusing the same part. Oh, says you. <clears throat> Am I doing it now? You actually only really do it when you're drunk. Aye, when I have to bring up part. something really funny, like, that we're forgot about, aye. He's reusing shite part and he's reusing shite cheese tactics as well. I'm just saying, see what you, Gary, like, say I spent... You're really good at critiquing me, by the way. How about I did to you for a while? Oh, you go. I don't care enough about you. <laughs> <laughs> that just sounds like a bit of a cop out. But you're not even worth my breath. <laughs> go on, one critique. On my character. Mm. <laughs> okay. 
Now, I, I'll give you a critique and I know it's for a fact that Stephen, fucking <coughs> that Stephen will agree with me on it. Right. I didn't block that. You're an ignoramus, pompous arsehole at times. What do you mean? Um, that you think your way is the best way and only way and Ryan is your clone and will immediately follow anything you say. You've literally got a fucking golem. <laughs> yeah, that... <coughs> Ryan is not a reflection on me. Ryan's himself. Are you trying to say that Ryan has not reinvented himself in near enough of your entire image? So... Yes, but he came to all those conclusions in his own. Why are you giving him <laughs> the conclusions? Nah, I was just like... No, in fact... So you were just like... And I he was not. like, ah, well, I'll just like... I didn't give him any conclusions. He just like was just... Oh, Tony, you're always happy. And I'm like, oh, well, you know, whatever. And then he just decided to copy all that. So... You're saying to me... That right now, you still... Right. <clears throat> so in any argument that you ever had with me... I did it again! Would you admit that you were wrong? No. <laughs> You've just proven my point. I, th- How many times have I been wrong? And admitted that I was wrong? <clears throat> I mean, I don't really know specifically. Why do I keep doing that? Stephen could tell you probably maybe, like... Yes, Gary, no, I can I confirm. Can. No, like, no in particular scenarios, but yes, Gary has done this. I can never... And all the time I've known you, all I the years... trying to get that hitting when I know I can. Alright. <clears throat> so, Tony, there you go. Judgment about your character. Oh, and also other judgment about your character. You are a horrible person with women. How? You just are. How? You d- 100%. <laughs> Haven't like you a- literally headbutted Kara? <clears throat> no, Kara headbutted me. Aye, but then you like, must have cracked her or something after it. Nope, she gave me a black eye, <laughs> burst my nose open, and burst my mouth open, and um, we were at her front door, and I pushed her in, shut the door. Surely, and then right, the... Me. The counter argument of that is like, <coughs> in your eyes, I make. Oh, the counter argument is that our auntie died and she wanted to hit me. No, no, no. The cut is you're a cock and you should just a crack that bitch. Bang! Straight through her head. Right. I'd a cracked her. I have definition in my arms now. I like it. I can see right here. Yeah. Aye, because you're pushing up the door. Oh, nice. I was awesome now. <laughs> <laughs> you want to go, boy? So the issue being right is that I don't want to turn around and be like. <coughs> Oh, I don't give a fuck, right? Because I, I hate it when people turn around and they're just like, I don't care when, like, they might care. It's no, not yeah, I understand that I you I care do about care. your opinion, but the thing is, is that all the stuff that you've said, I'm just like, yeah, that's me, and people are still my pals, so it can't be so bad as to counteract all I'm positive. You have a house that I can come to that's the only reason why we're friends. It's respectful, man. <laughs> at least he's honest <laughs> and you're good at magic now so we're like and plus as well now since then the channel we are all lumped together <laughs> we, are, we are just well, like, yeah, the cock. Pure, pure drunk the like cock so all, all three of our heads are like fused together it's oh, like that, that how it works it's drunk talk Tony I, I must have missed that drunk seminar can't slap in the pub well it is well it is well it is man well, in fucking well, well, separable down my of your bras I know my knees of your bras man look at my bras man this is this is Ryan now you know this is <laughs> <laughs> that well it brothers and this is Sam he sometimes comes in so it's like brothers man I like that Sam's been about more recently oh it's awesome yeah, it's good and I know that like, I, like he's been about recently since he like moved but like it's just good because we went so long with him just kind of floating about in the, the like the south side of the <coughs> or whatever yeah it's quite bad that we never really hung out that much in that period but and it makes you think like why the fuck didn't we because you know what I think it is? It's like that where, you know when you get so good and comfortable with someone, you don't feel like you need to... Yeah. You don't need to, like, see them to maintain the relationship. You've already yeah, made yeah. max relationship and that's never going to change. Yeah. Like, well, all us. Oh my yeah. god, that did so much damage. So it's kind of like that one. Hey there, Ma. <laughs> Daddy, no! <laughs> hey, Ma. No. Ma. No, you fucker. Ma. Ah, that was something else. That was something else. <laughs> that shuriken done so much posh damage. Are you are you not looking at me now? No. Oh, he got it. He got it. The fucker. Oh, I'm just gonna put it back then, ain't I? I don't know if I can sell it this much. Come on. You can destroy him. As long as you use your words. Fuck! I'm method acting right now. Fireworks never in a run out of the light room. Come on. <clears throat> there we go! Holy fuck! Well there done, we go! Man.